I'm really excited because SMI is announcing its new pricing intelligence suite. And what the suite consists of are a couple of key modules. The first is digital CPMs based on our census level billing data. We capture over $90 billion worth of billing in aggregate. Um, and what we've done with our digital CPM product is leverage our billing data to translate that down to digital CPMs at a very granular level. So whether it's looking at publisher uh, level pricing or looking at platforms, obviously with the birth and growth of OTT and streaming, there's a whole new series and classes of video uh, that weren't on the market before. So being able to get really good granular insights into pricing relative to OTT and streaming and video at large, as well as the second module, which is our linear ECPM product, which basically takes our unit rates, which we've kind of come become the authority in providing uh, TV pricing to the marketplace in the form of unit rates. And what we've done is partnered with uh, the top measurement companies to express that as a CPM. So in essence, looking at TV inventory and being able to price it on, a, on an effective CPM basis based on different audience dimensions. So the combination of these two pro products provides a unified view of, of CPMs across all classes of video, including TV. So you spoke about the sell side. What about the buy side? How do they utilize this? That's a great question. Really, the, you know, the, there's so much work right now in terms of trying to leverage video and optimizing uh, based on uh, different investment levels. So looking at um, all the emerging services, there's been a, a, an explosive growth on OTT and streaming. So there's a, a, a number of new services. So the real question is, how can one kind of apply their investment and get the maximum return? Where are those efficiencies set a different way? And how do the efficiencies on TV compare to video? So a lot of it on the buy side comes down to um, investment optimization, uh, campaign optimization, you know, whether it's looking at this broadly in, forms of, in terms of kind of video as a whole, or whether it's looking at a specific client or advertiser and understanding what the effective rates are in the marketplace and how they vary from one class of video to the next. So Ben, tell us sort of about the marketplace and demand for this new product, how you guys came up with it and sort of the conversations you're having with your clients. Thanks, uh, Andy. Yeah, the, the marketplace, there really is a huge void uh, on the digital side of the house in particular. You know, the only uh, kind of CPM insights that are available are either, you know, garnered through a survey or through some kind of qualitative research. So it's okay directionally, but it doesn't really help either the buyer or, or the sell side uh, in terms of optimizing on a like-for-like -like basis. So what is really important about our pricing intelligence product is the fact that uh, it's much more granular. So in addition to just average CPMs, uh, we also look at different dimensions around those buys, whether it's targeting dimensions, used to first or third party data, demographic versus behavioral targeting, or whether it has to do with some of those taxes on the CPM, such as ad serving fees uh, or uh, campaign verification, ID resolution. So for every CPM published, we have what we call a campaign composition to give you a sense of, give the buyers and sellers a sense of what went into that uh, CPM and to what extent it was targeting or different forms of uh, ad tech uh, that went into the uh, CPM calculation so that you can compare on a like for like basis. Great, and, and just tell us, uh, Ben, briefly about uh, SMI, what you guys are doing and kind of what the road, roadmap looks like. Well, you know, we've obviously become kind of the authority for ad spend in the marketplace because we have kind of a near census, you know, north of $90 billion of the billing uh, in our system. And our real focus now is to provide much more granular data sets. So this, uh, our new uh, pricing intelligence suite is kind of the first foray into that, where we're providing much more granular data that can be used in a real-time basis for optimization. And our, our whole goal going forward is to just to continue to add dimension around our data sets, whether is on the spend side of the house or whether it comes on the pricing side of the house. And then also to provide utility around the data. So if our clients wanna ingest the data directly into their own platforms, whether they're inventory management systems on the buy side or on the sell side, or whether they're campaign planning uh, tools on, on the buy side, that they can ingest the data and work with it 
in a much more actionable way than kind of conventional research in the past. 